Argentine prosecutor Alberto Nixman's death sparks protests. Mr. Nixman was found shot dead in his apartment in Buenos Aires on Sunday. He had been investigating the 1994 bombing of a Jewish center in Buenos Aires in which 85 people died. Officials said there was no evidence that anyone else was involved in his death, but demonstrators shouted no more lies and demanded a thorough investigation. Mr. Nesman's body was discovered just hours before he was due to give evidence to a congressional committee outlining his accusations against Argentina's President Cristina Fernández de Kirchner. Picture taken on July 16, 2013 showing Argentine prosecutor Alberto Nixman in Buenos Aires. He had accused the president and foreign minister Hector Timerman of involvement in a plot to cover up Iran's alleged role in the 1994 attack on the seven-story Amia Community Center. The government has dismissed the allegations as ridiculous. Investigating prosecutor Viviana Seen said that a preliminary autopsy suggested there was no intervention by others in Mr. Nitzman's death. Mr. Nesman's body was found by his mother and one of his bodyguards in the bathroom of his apartment in Buenos Aires. The apartment had been locked from the inside and the key was still inside the lock. Forensic tests suggest he died of a single gunshot to his temple at close range, officials said. The bullet retrieved from his head was fired from a gun which was lying next to his body, ballistic tests suggest. But M.S. Fiend said she was investigating whether Mr. Nesman may have killed himself after receiving threats. We could talk of a suicide, the body was neither beaten nor mistreated, but I don't rule out instigation, she said. We are calling his death suspicious, she added. Thousands of people demonstrated at different locations in Buenos Aires, including outside the presidential palace, and in number of other Argentine cities.